Hey, it's Angela from the blog, Angela Marie Made. Today I'm showing you how to build a thin DIY floating shelf. For our laundry room makeover, I wanted to add a floating shelf between our DIY cabinets for extra storage. But I want it to be a thin floating shelf so that it's a more modern and stylish look. This floating shelf is really easy to build. You only need two tools, a drill, and a miter saw. Alternatively though, you could also use 1x2s turned on their sides so that they're the same 3 quarter inch thickness. For the shelf lumber, I'm using quarter inch and half inch thick plywood. I have a full material list and tutorial on my blog which is linked below this video in the description box. Okay, let's get started with this shelf. Determine the measurements for your shelf and cut your lumber to size. I used a miter saw for our 3 quarter inch dowel and 1x2 and we had our plywood for the shelf cut at the home improvement store. I have my cut list for this three foot shelf on my blog linked below this video to reference if you're building the same size shelf or if you want to use it as a reference to adjust the size. Note, for a longer shelf, you will need more metal supports than I am using. The next step is to build the floating shelf frame support. Begin by adding wood glue to the ends of the three shorter square dowels. Then build the shelf frame support with the three shorter square dowels between the two longer square dowels using one and a quarter inch wood screws. For easy assembly, clamp the frame together and pre-drill pilot holes for the wood screws and slowly screw them in to avoid splitting the wood. Also, make sure the screws are flat against the wood or a little counter sunk beneath the surface. This will make it easier for installing on the wall later on. After the frame was built, Brandon went ahead and stained and added a top coat to the plywood and 1x2 trim for the floating shelf before installing it on the wall. I will link the stain color and polyurethane top coat we used below this video. The next step is to install the shelf frame support to the wall. Use a stud finder to determine where the wall studs are located. Then install the shelf frame support to the wall studs with three inch screws, making sure that it's level. Also, we screwed the shelf supports into the cabinets on each side of our shelf to make it extra sturdy. The last step is to install the floating shelf lumber. Place the half inch thick plywood on top of the shelf frame and the quarter inch thick plywood below the frame and clamp everything in place. Attach the plywood to the frame with one inch nails and a brat nailer. Next, clamp the 1x2 front trim board in place and attach it with one and a quarter inch brad nails. Finally, touch up any visible nail holes with some stainable wood filler. And that's it, a super easy and stylish thin floating shelf. thin floating shelf turned out. Let me know if you have any questions about it in the comments below. I'll be sharing the full laundry makeover really soon, so make sure to subscribe so you don't miss it. Thank you so much for stopping by.